really private, but we'll sting if you get close. Huh? And they rule by planet Mars, they stay determined and don't go. go. Don't make a Scorpio strike because they venom pack a punch. So you better come correct, cause like a shark, you can't get much. Scorpios get what they want, and what they want is what they get. That's they appreciate the ones they love, they ain't what the fake shit. Uh-uh. They don't really like people switching up, uh-uh. and they can't be kinda controlling like bitch. Shut the fuck up. Shut Scorpios up. are leaders and they always think ahead. And they also open minded, so you gotta give them credit. Give them. If you date in the Scorpio and they like you, they will make you happy. They also like a meal, so in the kitchen, no, you can't be like Scorpios are often trendy and they got the best drip. And they do not disappoint, man. You just gotta tap. Is real. You can keep doing people dirty and being a complete asshole and think God is going to bless you. It may not be today or tomorrow or next week. But what goes around comes back around. And when that bitch come back for you, it'll be tenfold. As I walk- Karma is real. You can keep doing people dirty and being a complete asshole and think God is going to bless you. It may not be today or tomorrow or next week, but what goes around comes back around. And when that bitch come back for you, it'll be tenfold. As- What's up, y'all? This is 1028 Awakenings and back again with another motherfucking video so i just wanted to be uh transparent with you guys i was recently uh admitted into the er the other day which was just yesterday um i'm okay but my vitals were perfect and i don't have diabetes or anything i'm actually very very healthy uh, but my head was really messed up. I was uh, vomiting everywhere. I was mad, dizzy, and I can't smoke weed anymore. Uh, it saddens me to share this information with you guys because I really enjoy uh, herbs. But what has happened is I believe that the energies that are coming into this atmosphere at this time is replacing um, our habits that could be codependent on you know, different things. And I feel like from July 21st, which is tomorrow until the 23rd, we're going to be recovering from unhealthy bonds and attachments. Uh, These energies will be replaced with happiness and joy and safety and security. This is a new cycle that we are now creating that will be birthing in something new. And we will be continuing to increase our inner strength and use logic over emotion as independent and narcissist controls our 5D. Um, our 5D New Earth is about love and divine union, and the inner feminine is glowing and, and it's growing very strong and stable within all of us. Okay, so I just wanted to share that with you guys because I don't know if I've ever told any of you guys that, but I think most of you guys think that way. There are people that I do burn it down with that no longer are doing it as well. So I just want to let y'all know. All right. All right, so Scorpios, let's go ahead and let's see what's going on in the grid for my Scorpios, all right? Honestly, it's just a cold turkey thing for me. I just cannot do it. Like, it's just, it's crazy, but it is what it is, and I'm sure they're going to replace it with something great, okay? All right, so Scorpio, we talk about a water sign and angel numbers right now, okay? So somebody could be seeing shit and being like, damn, you know what I'm saying? What the fuck is... What the fuck is Scorpio doing or a Cancer or a Pisces, okay? So you have a water sign that's thinking about how like things are lining up for them and they're seeing a lot of confirmation or this could be you, Scorpio, okay? So you kind of think about going with the flow, all right? You could be seeing 12-12 a lot as well. All right, so Scorpio, somebody is thinking about a phase that happened in their life, okay? This is somebody who gave up on a particular thing, and they're thinking that they shouldn't. Well, I mean, with this being upside down, Scorpio, you should never give up on something. Like, if you think about it more than three times a day or two times a day, it's supposed to be in your life, okay? Um, But if you find somebody or you meet somebody, be like, fuck them, you don't talk about them, you don't think about them no more, then yeah, it's time for that person to go. Somebody walked away from something that they can't stop thinking about, okay? This is somebody who wants to surrender, and they keep seeing signs and synchronicities that keep reminding them of this person or this place and person, place, or thing. Okay, Scorpio, damn, somebody put some real boundaries around you. Whatever boundaries that they put around you, you got acclimated to them, okay? These boundaries, you done set up shop, you know, you know, you just living the life here, okay? So somebody definitely uh, gave up on you and they set boundaries around you that they want to take down. I feel like whatever boundaries that these, this, these people have up, whether this be a friend or a lover or whatever this is for so many of you guys, people, so many people, 
You don't give a fuck. You got adapted to living your life the way that you feel is suitable for you. Okay? And you get a lot of confirmation by everything that you do in your life. This is really good, Scorpio. Damn. Okay? So somebody feels like, you know, backstabbing you or giving up on you really put them in the doghouse or really just put them in a place where they don't feel protected. They don't feel like they're walking with God. That's kind of fucked up. Damn. Middle of the day energy. Scorpio, you got a lot of money coming towards you and you're going to be overcoming a lot of obstacles. Okay? So a lot of money is going to be coming towards you. So if you think that you're going to be having financials like speed bumps or there's something that's not going to be moving silly, it's actually going to be going really, really good. Okay? With mounting the obstacles here... Um, I just feel like ain't no van low enough. Okay, I don't know where the hell that came from, but I just feel like you're not gonna run into any problems. Okay, damn Scorpio, somebody want peace. They hope that you'll be able to do this. Also, like you could need to clean your refrigerator, or there could be something on your refrigerators, like um different little things to remind you of different things. Also, Scorpio, peace is coming into your life. You could be seeing four 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 a lot and six six six. Okay, Scorpio. All right, so let's see what else is going on. What's going on in Scorpio's love life? I don't know why I'm getting so tongue-tied, okay? All right, so somebody, damn. So, Scorpio, somebody backstabbed you, said fucked up shit about you, gave up on your ass, and put boundaries about you, um, around you, wants balance. Everything that they're seeing is drawing them back to you, okay? This could be your energy or theirs, but I'm telling you, this is somebody who stabbed you in the back. Now, the thing about this situation is that even though this person stabbed you in the back, you did not get that person that same energy. With stab in the back in reverse, you always had this person's back. You always try to take over this person in some kind of way. And balance needs to be restored into this situation. So somebody who was two-faced is coming to speak to you, Scorpio. All right. This is somebody who sailed the fuck away from you. All right. This is somebody who moved on from you, but they never really did. OK, so this person could have physically left your ass, but mentally, you know, in, in their night time realms, they, they, they be they be on you kind of hard. OK, so somebody could. Yeah. All right. This person also feels like they were never good enough. So when you guys were in a relationship or when you guys were friends, they always felt like you was better than them. OK. And you always felt like the underdog to this person. Like you actually made this person look better. But this person felt like that about you with the Phoenix rising. You just unapologetically shine bright. OK. And that always made this person feel like they was not enough to be next to you. Not enough to rock with you. Not enough to even say that you was their girl or you were their boy. Thing about this, y'all, we're also equally yoked. Bottom of the deck energy is the twin flame. This person is the yin and yang. This is the second time this is coming up in your reading. So this person actually completes you. But for some reason, this person's energy was low. Maybe they were being drugged by another energy. Maybe they just didn't feel adequate, you know, but... There is balance coming in, Scorpio. Somebody wants to equal out the playing field. They want unity, okay? And somebody wants to work together. This is nice. This this is really nice. So a twin is coming in. They do want balance. You could be seeing 444. I love you guys. Keep your eyes Nor open. and outperform them. You see, while you're over there watching me and talking about me, I'm working. I'm working hard. I'm taking things to the next level.